Oh, hi, everyone. How are y'all tonight? Sorry, I'm early and late all at the same time. Make that make sense. Uh, hey, Grace. Hey, Ryan. Hey, Rocket Couch. Hey, Sean. Hey, Fish Nerd. Hey, uh, Juju. Hey, look at the trees. Hey, everyone. Who else did I miss? Did I miss anyone? Did I say hey to Sean? Hey, Sean. Oh, uh, so, yeah. Um, sorry, running late. Uh, yeah, totally, uh, did that to myself. So, <laughs> how's everyone doing tonight? Hey, Squabob. Oh, hang on one second, y'all. Hang on one second. Y'all noticed I redecorated. Ha, ha, ha. Just a little bit. I'm still trying to get this plant in the place I want to get that plant at. He's not in the right spot. Hang on one second. I'll be back. I'll just watch the fish for a minute. Hey, Cat Ninja. All right. I'm back now. I uh, didn't quite have everything set up to feed the fishes, so uh, yeah, I'm running behind there. Oh, boy. It's been a long week, and it's only Wednesday, y'all. Been a long week. Ninja Cat! Cat Ninja. It is, it is very green today. Um, I think that has to do with some of the stuff I took out of the tank. Um, I did try to remove some of the plants, but it's like they just grew back real quick. So, you know, it, it gets that way. Plus, I had a little container in there that had some red going on. Oh, I know what the problem is. I know what we're missing. Dark stole the remote again. Darth, what did you do with that remote, buddy? I think Fishius took my remote. That's what, that's what, that's the problem. Uh, that, those are actually rocks. Uh, I added some new rocks in there. I mean, they're not hard to miss. They're, you know, but they are the same color as the ivory uh, snails. No way. Um, I don't know. Um, that is so awesome. <laughs> that is awesome. Uh, I don't know where to put it. Um, I guess we could maybe ask. I don't know. Um, yeah, send it to Juju on Discord. And. Yeah, I guess I kind of need to make a discord for the fishy place. <laughs> okay, let me get this bad boy on here. The light actually helps change the color of the tank. Isn't that crazy? Without this little bad boy, it does look very green. <laughs> there better be a snorgy square. <laughs> Fish cord. <laughs> okay, we're going with blue tonight. There we go. The blue seems to help a little. I don't know why. In the color wheel theory, does blue... I thought red canceled out green. Thank you, Juju. I, I don't know if like I'll hit all the topics, but I do appreciate that rocket couch. That is awesome. I, I really do. 
you know what? Let's actually pin that. Um, I almost, oh, wait. Juju, can you pin that? Because I, I guess I can't. <laughs> um, oh boy, I don't know. Uh, we'll have to figure out prizes uh, later. I haven't even fed the fish yet, y'all. How many times will I move the cameras? <laughs> the square. <laughs> Okay, let me get these guys some food since I haven't fed them yet and they haven't had dinner yet. <laughs> and I will tell you this, I did notice one of the plecos, actually the one on screen, I think he's going to be a long fin little guy. He's got some long fins forming. And let's get them some green beans. No, I didn't accidentally lose my scissors that I used to cut their food up with. Not at all. Ah. There actually is a squabob somewhere. Squabob just hasn't made a tank appearance yet. It's coming though. Barrel is also going to end up in the tank too. He is very, uh, he's testing my patience. To a, a squab is coming to a tank near you. If the green beans don't attack me first. Usually I cut all this stuff up before I start the stream. And today took a turn. Mr. Mousy did not get off or as early as I thought he was going to get off. That was a thing. But it's been kind of crazy at his work. They've had a lot of developments. So I will forgive him this week for, you know, being behind. It is what it is. Sometimes you can't help it. All right. Let's get these little plecos. You know what? I kind of want to get them on one side of the tank. And then, yeah, we're going to do that. All the fish are like, hey, we don't like the green. Well, they do. They just don't like them right now. All right. Those baby guppies are everywhere. Oh, nope. That's the wrong bag. We'll pop that over there. Sorry, Juju. Here, you know what? I'm going to crinkle for a second. Let me mute. Okay. All right. Well, no. Okay. Sorry. Now I'm done. Now I'm done crinkling. <laughs> no, and I can't. It, it can get rather annoying. See, I'm still doing it. Oh, my God. Like, I got to stop. 
Oh, okay. Now I'm done feeding the fishies. They're going to be real happy in, in just a second when that cube of uh, bloodworms, you know, drops down. They're going to be real happy. And now they actually have to hunt for them. So, um, you know, I fed them sweet potato and I have fed them yellow squash and zucchini. So I guess they might eat butternut squash. I'm sure we could try it. It wouldn't hurt. I mean, I enjoy butternut squash, so whatever they don't eat, I could definitely eat. Yeah, it, it, it's it's that, or um, do, do I need to call you back? Are you busy? And it's like, oh shit, I'm, I'm crinkling again. I do crinkle a lot. I'm, I'm real noisy. I'm a noisy mouse. You know, for all things considered, I am very noisy. So, yeah, today I found a big bag of these, uh, like, almost river stones. It's, like, a little bigger than pea gravel, you know? Um, ooh. I have not done that, but I should probably have, I should probably try doing that. That that is really true, Grace. But, I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> I was also gonna switch the lights out tonight because that kind of helps with all the green in the background. But uh, I I didn't get to that point yet. So. Please. Yeah, we definitely have a lot of baby guppies in this tank. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to fix that. I think that one quarry is about to go crazy if those blood worms don't um those blood worms don't hit the ground. He's kind of freaking out a little. It's like, man, I wanted dinner. Come on. Gonna have to come up with um, prizes for the bingo winners. All right, let me. I have some other music. We're gonna try this tonight. Let's see how this works out. Give me a minute and I I will watch that work. Is it is the snail like a um yeah, everything goes just maybe give me your address, I'll send you as many as you want. So um three out of the four clutches have now hatched. We got a lot of baby snabies. Oh, that's a good idea, trees. Now Cat Ninja got a got a bingo. <laughs> you get to choose do you um <laughs> There's your prize, y'all. <laughs> you know what? Well we'll uh Saturday or Saturday or Sunday night, we'll see what we can get going with the snails. I'll see which day works out better for them. And, uh, yeah. 
we'll have a nice little little snorgy night. Oh, sorry. I know that's kind of bright. I'm trying to... There it is. That's the setting. That's the one that works. Hey, firsty. First shot. First one shot. Hey. <laughs> Yo, I almost forgot to open my water tonight. That's how late I was running. It's like, man, I schedule an early stream and I'm late for it. Oy, I gotta get my stuff together. I'm really surprised. Um, <laughs> I'm really surprised that the tank is not cloudier than I thought it was going to be. Because we were digging around, putting new plants in. Uh, I finally got two of the new plants that didn't want to stay in the substrate. In the substrate, I totally didn't weight them down with rocks at all. I totally did that. Um, and then we added the new rocks. They were a little dusty. They were a little dusty. And so, yeah, I'm real surprised. Gonna. Definitely do a water change tomorrow, though. Real paranoid about the cloudy water situations. Exactly, right? Definitely got to do that on the weekend. <laughs> really, darn. You, you don't say. You know what's you know what's crazy? The actual fish tanks don't smell as fishy as the plant tanks that I have. I fixed his tail with love and magic and a whole lot of methylene glue. <laughs> like legit. A whole lot of methylene blue. Like, I did that on stream. Y'all were all here for it. And I just dumped that all in the tank. That was, that was my, that was my biggest moment right there. The one thing we could say was that night, the tank was not green. You know, I'm surprised because he did take a chunk out of the, um, his doppelganger's tail. Is he, if you'll notice this guy right up here. Okay. We got, that's the first dirt, dirt, dopp, doppelganger. And then we got this little guy down here that also kind of looks like Darth. But they don't have, um, they don't have spots on their tail like Darth Fishius does. Like, they try to be him, but they can't be Darth Fishius. He's like, no, I'm the big guy in charge. I think some of the quarries have eaten a little too much. Just one guy's just sitting there like, oh my goodness, I can't. I couldn't possibly eat another blood worm as I eat another blood worm. Like, what are you doing there, little guy? Let's scoot these guys up. I didn't even check to see what I had the uh, tanks. The... <laughs> exactly. Yo, I'm like... I'm a little upset with Team U right now, okay? So, the king of DIY. Right? Right? He did a tank, and he used items from Team U, right? Actually put them in his, um, in his little, ooh, that was already down. Sorry. Um, put it in his, like, description, those items, right? So I'm like, cool, because they have this one above tank filter. And I was like, oh, that's, like, really cool, like, 
I sent it to Fish Nerd. I was like, we should check into this. They took it off. They took it off the website. But now you can find the thing on Amazon for like three times the price. I'm like, that's not even cool. Like, someone's bought all those and then went to Amazon to sell them. I'm like, I think that makes sense. But buyer beware if you buy anything from Timu for your aquarium. You know. Yeah, they are not hard to build at all. So I am thinking I will just, you know, build myself a couple because some PVC and a couple of containers, and then bam, there you go. I bet you are. I bet it was you too. That would that would totally make sense. Yeah, I mean that's pretty much true. And I haven't checked um, because apparently, if you look at Sheen and you look at Team you, like they're the same site, really. I mean almost exactly mirrored sites so i may uh may check that out definitely not buying anything off of those <laughs> that's actually because that little fish likes to fight so that one works pretty good. <laughs> Can't fight. I'll be right back. Okay, no kitties were injured in that little kitty kerfuffle that just happened. Someone's, um, someone's feelings got hurt, but, you know, everyone's okay. They're fine. <laughs> I think that someone got near someone else's food bowl. It happens. You have a D&D &D tonight? Oh, no. All right. Well, I will see you later, Juju. He really is. I'm going to have to start, like, giving them that before I stream from now on. Like, seriously, just put that all over the house. Absolutely, Juju. Just text me when you're done, and I'll be around. Uh, I'm not going to stay on here um, a whole, I'll probably be like live for another 20 minutes, y'all. Let y'all watch the little fishy guys. But I think all the little baby plecos are out too. Okay. I need to count them real quick. Yes. All of them are out and accounted for. I was afraid one had decided to, um, uh, like, uh, dive under a pile of rocks earlier. Maybe a little longer. We'll see how it goes.
<laughs> Got it. Now that Juju's not here, I'm gonna move the camera, y'all. I'm gonna play with the camera now. <laughs> Let's see what's going on over here on the green bean side of, of things. Let's just whoop, oh, or not do that. I did not notice the cord was all kinds of twisted. That have been bad. We have the the vegetarian buffet. Um. Oh yeah, let me show you the snabies. Okay. After tonight. <laughs> Sorry, Juju. All right, we're gonna wait till Juju's gone, and then I'll show you guys the snabies. Because I have to get the rest of them moved tonight. I already did one moving. Now I've got to do it again. We have so many in that little in that little uh, breeder box. You know why, Darth? Because he likes the. I don't know. Well, okay. One, he has decided he just likes to be front and center. Like, in a minute, he's going to notice I moved over to the green beans, and he's going to go over there. He's going to be like, oh, no one's over here. I got to go see what's going on. It's just the way it is. See? I told you. He, he saw me move the camera. He's very observant, too. He, he does take he does take after after dark like a whole lot very observant okay all right we're gonna we're gonna look at the snail babies okay first we're gonna see how the the hatching clutches have done since you know I thought only one was gonna hatch and we got all of them hatching like all of the clutches except for one that one that one didn't i have learned things this week about this, these nails definitely been a week okay so let's move some stuff around here all right so first off we have the new babies that are hatching. Those guys are, you know, hanging out doing their thing. The, the second one, I don't think too many are going to hatch out of that one. But that other one is really doing its thing. Those guys are busting free. And then I've already cleaned the breeder box out once, okay, y'all? But if you can see up in there... We do have a lot of babies in that box. So, I gotta get them out of there tonight so they don't escape into the big tank. Otherwise, I'm not gonna see them again until they get to be size of peas. <laughs> it's just, it's not gonna happen. They're gonna be... They're not gonna be able to be found. Right now, I've got, um, I've been putting uh, fish flake and little bits of green beans in the other part of the tank that I have. I have another 10 gallon set up for them. But yeah, they're, they're eating all the food. And I've got a green bean in this one for them to like congregate to. Yeah, pretty much that. <laughs> Hey, Teresa! Long time to see! Not really. I, you know, I did see a couple days ago. <laughs> How you doing, Teresa? How's it going? Oh, no! I 
forgot to silence my phone. Teresa, I have seen Teresa's bagels. Oh my goodness. She makes the prettiest bagels I have ever seen in my entire life. I was so sad. I, I saw the picture and I was like, but I want one of those bagels too. Like, those are beautiful. Like I've never seen any bakery put out a bagel as pretty as those. Honestly, Teresa, for the first time you had ever made them, I would have never, never known that. Yeah, and I kind of have a bagel problem, too. It's called if I eat one, I want another one. So, also, y'all, my kiddo went and got a tattoo this week. They live in Colorado. They've lived up there for like two years now. And they went and finally did a thing and got a tattoo. And I'm really surprised because they're not the, the kind of kiddo that, you know, is big on the, um, big on the tattoos. Well, They've always wanted one, but, you know, pain and stuff involved in tattoos, but they got one and I'm, you know, they were, they, they did it to celebrate their promotion to the, um, my kiddo is a mother, you know, but I love them. Yeah. She also did get a promotion too. She's now the assistant manager in the bakery. Well, you know what? Bagels are yummy. So I can't blame her. You should pick me up a couple too. <laughs> the ones I have, honestly... Like, I have one that's visible, so I'm not really worried about getting them zapped off. You know. I can cover them up, so. You're only young and, you know, live once, so you might as well have fun. Now, my youngest kiddo, when they found out, they were like, yeah, I, they were like, I can't do a tattoo. <laughs> they also don't like getting shots either. So it's a whole needles thing. Which is good because, you know, no piercings either. <laughs> But I did let one of my kiddos pierce my ears and my nose. Make that make sense.
Oh, well, Teresa, now Fishner's in trouble because he's going to have to make us some pretzels. <laughs> That's tonight's hashtag, y'all, free nerds pretzels. <laughs> I'm excited about it warming up, y'all. All the flowers are starting to bloom here. I also did not notice the amount of wisteria that we have in my area. I don't know if it's just the trees always bloom before like the leaves come back before the wisteria blooms if it bloomed early this year i don't know what happened but there are purple flowers everywhere this year that one too that bo both are good <laughs> Hopefully, y'all, by this time next week, this tank will be officially done with all the plants I want to put in it. I've got a couple more that I want to put in there, and I want to get these rocks scattered out a little bit more, you know, um, you know, like move, like fit them out somewhere, like spread them further. But after that, then I'm uh, definitely going to start working on the next tank. I was wondering what that was in the background and it's the uh the wire i was like what is that line back there in the tank it's like please don't be a crack that would have been so sad that is not wrong at all that and i have to get that little plant guy moved from next to the wood now that I have a stone on him to keep him down. That's how you make plants sleep with the fishes. You super glue a rock to them. The snails found the green beans. Oh, okay. Well then, I, you know what? I, I have a, like a, I had a whole 10 pound bag of them and we might have used a quarter of the bag in here so i may still put some more like in the back of the tank too you yeah, know extra hiding spots plus you know the rocks are good for surface area bacteria you know all that fun stuff you want to grow in your tank We have not had a lot of Paris nails tonight. I was very sad about that. It's like they were waiting for dinner. They have really piled up over there by the bubbler. I am going to have to move that back. It looks like it, yeah. I think when I plugged the tubing back up, I pulled it back a little too far because it's kind of sitting on the plant. So yeah, I'm gonna have to gonna have to move that. Yeah, I've got a I've got another tank coming that I'm working on setting up. We we already have a plan for what's gonna what's gonna go in it. But the fish have already been decided upon for the tank. So hopefully beginning of may we'll, we'll have that ready maybe the end of uh end of april but it'll be close it'll be close definitely close <laughs>
if I, you know what, Garth, if I can figure out everything I would need for an octopus tank, and if I think I can actually do the octopus tank, I will, I will totally do that. Actually, <laughs> there is a fish that I do want to get. Hang on. I'm going to have to. We're going to end that in, in the stream on this tonight. Because my kiddo sent me this video. And I'm sure I can find it on YouTube real quick. But she found this fish. And I was like, oh my goodness. I really want this fish. The only thing is, it is a saltwater fish. It is probably really expensive. And I don't even know where I'd find this fish at. But if I ever had a saltwater tank, this would be one of the fish I could so let me find this real quick. Um, yeah, I saw this and I about lost it. Okay. And this thing is like three years old. This video is, I really hope I don't, um, I don't think I will, but we're going to, I'm going to share it anyway. You know, what's worse? I mean, I can always cut it out later if I if need be. Um, and it's not a garami. I, I, cause I've, I've heard that they do that too. Okay, hang on one second, y'all. Okay. Let me turn the sound of it off real quick. Okay. I know, right? <laughs> you know, I did ask Mr. Mousy if I could do a pond, but unfortunately, I can't do a pond. I actually have one of those now. <laughs> but... Oh my goodness. So yeah, let me uh let me pull this up so we can take a look at this guy. Um share screen. Yeah. Oh, that would be fun. That would be real fun. Okay, but this guy, this guy right here. You know what? Let's do full screen mode. And let's hit play. One more time for the boys in the back. Sir, I know that you're bored, but that doesn't mean you can spit everywhere. That doesn't mean you can spit everywhere, sir. Please stop. Please. That guy. That fish right there. That guy is the most... That fish has all the personality. A cowfish. Yes. I think that is, is actually what that is. is yeah. But oh my goodness, that is hilarious. Like he gets mad and he just, you know. <laughs> Isn't he adorable? Look, here, I'm gonna I'm gonna play some more in the video. Maybe, you know, we're gonna do it in small sections. But yeah, it's hilarious. Like, oh wrong, wrong one. I do know how to do this occasional. <laughs> I know. Why would I possibly want a fish that's going to spit at me, right? Like, why would I want that? Yeah. You don't like, you don't like that. You can give it out, but you can't take it, right? Say goodbye to your water privileges, <laughs> buddy. Say goodbye. <laughs> Say 
See? <laughs> you know, like, the Darkfish already doesn't have enough attitude, y'all. But seriously. <laughs> Okay, let me stop that. Okay. So. Yes. That, that is the most hilarious uh, fish I think I've ever seen next to the Darth fish. Because that fish has attitude. Darth Squab is a myth. <laughs> he was a rude little fishy, right? He was great. All right, y'all. I guess I'm going to wrap it up for tonight. Um, I will be back this weekend. Probably a couple of times. I hope y'all have a good week. If you haven't checked out Darth Hideous' channel. He has one. I don't have the link right now to share it. You know what? Let me grab it. Um, he does the rumble too. He really likes the rumbles. And um, so if you have the rumble, check him out on rumble. And, yeah. I need to actually start streaming on the Rumble, too. Because, you know. Streaming two places is always better than streaming at one place. Oh, my goodness. I forgot how to type, y'all. That's seriously what happened. Forgot how to type, forgot how to spell. You know, it's just one of those days. I really also need to... Keep my actual YouTube chat open. Yes, rumbles does equal the better. <laughs> I'll see y'all later, everyone. Y'all have a good night. And, you know, go check out Darth. Because Darth is just as interesting as the fishy. All right. Have a good week. I will see y'all later. Uh, Grace Case on her channel over on Shenanigans is doing game night. If y'all like games, um, I will be over there playing some games. Let me grab Shenanigans link real quick too, because um, Juju has a has a real grub problem right now. <laughs> Oh, no. Okay. There we go. Let me grab that link real quick, too. Let me pop that in there. I need to actually, you know, maybe bookmark these. That would help. Oh, okay. My computer is... What are you doing here, buddy? All 
Okay, I'll pop shenan shenanigans. <laughs> oh my goodness, I can't even speak anymore. I'll pop shenanigans link down in the um, description box after the stream because for some reason it won't let me copy your thing. It's kind of annoying me. So let me grab that little linky real quick. Grab the link. What am I doing wrong here? Besides everything. I'm just kidding. There we go. Ha ha. I think I got it. Ha ha. I think it's my uh, batteries. I I didn't charge the uh, yeah. I didn't charge them before I put them back in the mouse. There we go. There's shenanigans. <laughs> so go play some games with us. I will see y'all later. I'm getting out of here. Y'all have a good night. Bye.